see your, you've read the script. Um, let me start with you because you've got the freshest perspective on this. First thoughts, be they bad, be they good. Uh, of course, let's walk through maybe overall, right? Uh, overall, and then we'll go through each of the four chapters. Okay. Um, overall, I think it's really good. Um, I don't really have any notes for the the action, the storyboard portion of uh -huh. it um i just have a few notes and a few questions um about the um the dialogue um the first question i wanted to ask was in your mind um how how what is do you have like a desired duration for all four sections um i, I think Sam had, i timed it at 30 seconds for the last three and like 15 seconds or less for the first one. So maybe a little over a minute and a half. Okay. For the dialogue, would it just be the narrator saying this or would it be um, a combination between the narrator and a, a person on camera? So did you watch the Book of Cultures video? Yeah, in that case, it was a combination between the narrators and the founders of the company. So is it like an exact copy of that or would our script just be just the narrator speaking or would it be a person on camera speaking what do you think sir i was thinking just a narrator okay yeah I was, I, that was the same vision that i had in my mind too so all right can you guys see that yep yep so the reason i kept this in here was because I wanted to like introduce the audience to the book right away as soon as possible. But I do feel like it doesn't really fit because we go from them holding the books to down here, the parent with all this, all the troubles going on. And then he hears the doorbell, the male kid is dressed as a mailman, hands in the package, and then he brings him to the family room and uh, they all open the books. So I'm thinking maybe not have them holding the books at the beginning. Or what do you guys think? That was actually something that I was actually thinking about. So going back to what I was thinking about, like each section answering a question, you have who, how, what, and why. I was actually thinking maybe you should switch the first and the I'm sorry, not the first, the second and the third section. Answer the question of who Burst is, what you do, and then how you do it, and then why you do it. Instead of how, I'm sorry, who, how, what, why. What, what I like about is. this is, I mean, you're right, it's not as specific, but it still has a call to action, but it lets us use this video in other contexts. Mm -hmm. It could be just a g general trailer for the company as a whole like what we're here for in a minute and a half. That's the video. Whereas if we say the word Kickstarter, that make, makes it automatically less than useful for those moments. I mean, if they're on our Kickstarter page and they're watching our video, I think the connection is close enough, is clear enough of, of what we're trying to do. I almost want to ask you, maybe not say this like in the narration, but definitely there should, like the last screen should be something to the effect of like, and this is like post-production stuff, but I've, I do feel like somewhere in the video, there has to be something specific, like, I don't know, maybe like follow us on Instagram or something. Just to like, cause join us is a little bit too general. Maybe we can say this right before the join us, we can say a sentence that says, back us on Kickstarter and we can begin this journey together. All right, everybody, thank you. Thank you all. Thank you, G and Cindy. Thank you so much. Bye.